Real Mob, you started recording. We have some stuff to react to. Mm-hmm. How is it now? From because a year ago it was an idea, but yeah. now you started putting it into motion. So, yeah. how, how's it been getting into Gorilla Mob or making content for Gorilla Mob? Uh, it's been good. It's been good. Um, I wasn't really serious about it until one day I just up. Uh, well, I had an interview. I had mm-hmm. an interview for like another position at my job. Oh, okay. And. uh I had, I had went, I went to the interview and I had just got in and out within like ten minutes, right? Mm-hmm. So then I'm like, I had nothing else to do, so I'm like, I'm gonna go hit up the sticker, the sticker place, like the place that makes the stickers. Yeah. And I went to go, I went to the sticker place, and I told him to give me a quote on what it would be like to get a Gorilla Mob sticker done. And uh, yeah, bro, sure enough, I went up there. They gave me a couple of examples. I, I chose one. Well, I chose two. Yeah. And they say, hey, you, you gotta choose one, and, you know, and then it's your Gorilla Mob font is gonna be on the bottom. All right, so I chose the one that that's there right now, the one with the gorilla bee in his chest. Yeah. And uh, sure enough, a week later, they gave me the stickers. I looked at it, and I'm like, all right, I got to get serious with this shit now. Yeah. So then so I got the gorilla mod sticker, and then uh, I had got this truck. And well, I, I really liked to film the truck, and plus I had a spam page. Oh. I had a spam page. It all started off the spam page, and I wasn't really posting on there. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going to make the spam page into my gorilla mod page. So yeah. I told all my followers, you know, so I was stupid. I'm like, hey, bro, I'm going to get off of here. It's going to be, this, this page is going to be repurposed for something else. Yeah. Uh, it's going to be for my Gorilla Mob page. You're, you're welcome to stay. If not, you know, whatever, do your thing. Mm, we but, got two people here. Hurry up and turn 21, man. School for Chumps said that. Brian said, Gorilla Mob. I want to be like Gorilla Mob. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, damn. damn so you get se- so you getting serious you get yeah, real serious man. yeah damn. so where's the sticker place at it's in uh you know what denny's is at on yeah. on um lake worth yeah like right there like behind the store oh. behind there is like a shopping center and then like, there's a place called signs by tomorrow they're the ones signs. that actually yeah shout right. out signs by tomorrow by the way yeah man because i i definitely like to make fucking stickers and put them on cars do that yeah because that's how once you once you make like a laminated type sticker, mm-hmm. you look serious. Yeah. Like once you once you start putting certain things in motion and you look a certain way, mm-hmm. you catch eyes. Yeah, and I mean, I printed out like my first round of stickers were too big. They were really big, like mm-hmm. humongous. So uh, I just gave them out as much as I could. I gave them to my brother, my sister, my dad, my my mom, of course, my cousins, mm-hmm. and then I put one on my truck. And then afterwards, my other friends were hitting me up like, "Hey." Give me a sticker. Give me a sticker. sticker. I'm like, sticker. Well, shit, I gotta go. Re- I gotta go reload. And I went. I shortened it down. And yeah. And then after that, you know, like I said, I had this truck, and I really liked the truck. And you know, I wanted mm-hmm. to practice on how my videos were going, or how my video shoots were gonna go. So I just got up, went outside, started recording. And then it took me like, it took me a couple. It took me a while it took you a to while? edit it. To edit it. Yeah. And, and then like it took me like I think it was like two like two hours almost because I had to find the song. Yeah. And then uh, I remember I was laying down in bed at night. It was like 2 o'clock in the morning, and I had it ready. And I was watching it over and, and over, over and over. And I'm like, all right, this shit looks pretty cool. So then I uploaded it on, on Instagram, and I think I got like six likes out of it. Yeah. But, shit, that was a lot. To me, yeah. I was like, hey, you, six yeah. people like this shit. So I'm like, hell yeah, I'm going to keep going. Yeah. Hell so yeah. then from there, bro, it just blew up. And then I was like, shit, every time, I'm, every time I see a cool truck, I'm going to take my chance and just ask if they want a video. Or mm. if I go to a truck meet nowadays, I'm going to... I went to a truck meet yesterday, yeah. and then my my first goal there was just to film as many trucks as I could, Damn. and they're all pretty cool. And I'm working on that right now. So, damn it! So you really turned it around? Yeah, hell yeah! That's yeah. same thing here, same thing here. Doing kind of doing the same thing. I want to buy more different equipment because you said some of the things is kind of the same since yeah. you last been here. Yeah, but there's small differences. But I want to make those small ones big ones. Yeah, of course. You know what I mean? So it depends what I do next. I mean, I don't want to. Like, one time, I remember my brother, he told me, why don't you rent out a studio place? I'm like, that'd be cool, but, like, it'd be better if I was earning money for this and then putting it into that. Yeah. Because it would look badass if you have, like, because I got a a set amount of square feet right here that I put together. And I was Mm -hmm. like, okay, this is is how it'll work. But then imagine if you had something bigger and you had the means to do it. Yeah. That's good. It's take, it takes a lot to do it, bro. Like, uh-huh. literally, like, laziness and procrastination is a motherfucker. Oh, yeah. It really is. Because you could be going, you could be on a good path and then drop right away. And you're like, fuck, I don't feel like doing it anymore. Yeah. But and, then, yeah, man. And I had a lot of those paths, especially when I, I did gaming. Because I still post there every now and then. Or, like, I try to post as much as I do when it comes to podcasting. But 
I get I get like no views on those. <laughs> you but then again, I'm like I'm not really trying. There's just like gaming videos I've always put out just for fun. Yeah, you know, and that. That one blew up with other things, like mm-hmm. not not those videos, but they blew up with certain things that went viral. Yeah, you know, but it's always that one thing that could go viral. Yeah, like right now, uh, I think my one thing that went viral, well, kind of viral, I, it had like four thousand views. Yeah, so it's kind of viral to me. But um, well, technically it's fucking viral. Yeah, yeah, but, uh, technically, yeah. It's, but uh, it was just it was an unplanned thing, bro. Like I remember, I, my mom told me she goes, "Hey, go wash my car." All right, cool. So I went to the I went to the car wash. And uh, there's a store right there by Northside, yeah. that corner store. And I went over there, and I had to go get change. I told the guy, you know, give me some change or whatever. And I see my friend Alex, Alex Torres. Yeah. You know him? So I seen him. like, hey, bro, uh, the truck's pretty cool, man. Because like, he did a lot of stuff to it, and it sounded yeah. pretty badass. And we were having a casual conversation. Yeah. And I told him, like, look, bro, uh, I really like your truck. You know, can I shoot a video? Let me shoot it, yeah. And he goes, bro, I'm, I'm, I'm in a hurry right now. I'm like, bro, it'll be just quick. You'll back out. I just want to see. I just want to record you backing out and peeling out on the street. <laughs> and, and he goes, he goes, peeling out. Like, yeah, bro. He goes, I have a fender in the back of my truck. And you want me to peel out? I'm like, dude, just do it, bro. Just do it. <laughs> and me and this fool, we had, we pick at each other back and forth. And he, finally, he gives me a liar, bro. So he backs out. And uh, sure enough, he does what I told him to do. And I put a little Suicide Boys song behind it, Paris. Yeah, Suicide Boys. Yeah. And that shit blew up. Ooh. It blew up to like four thousand views, and I have like a hundred and eighty likes on it. Yeah, and it's a, it, I put it in as a reel, as yeah. a reel. Oh, it's the real, the yeah. reels are the shit. Yeah, reels, and then uh, shout out Brian, he's gonna put me on that shit. So yeah, put it in as a reel, got a lot of views. Uh huh. They took away IGTV. I, oh, Did I saw you? that. Yeah. yeah, I saw that. I was gonna try to. Uh, I, tr- I was gonna. Well, I was. I was mostly depending on that for my videos, yeah. especially on Instagram, but. Now you just tap on it. You, you just, just tap on the video and yeah, it just and it's, pulls it's up. a full video. Yeah. And they took away titling. Like I can't title my clips anymore. Hence why like I put it in the description. Really? Yeah, for some reason cuz IGTV they let you put a title, but now when it's a video they just oh, say yeah, yeah. Dis- oh, description yeah. like a regular post. Oh, damn. So, so that's weird. That. It's weird but the reels though, the reels are the shit because yeah, the reels are a lot the reels are a lot a lot better. The first time I went viral was one of my clips with my buddy Ray. And I don't know what we were talking about. We were talking about something random. Mm-hmm. And I just put it out there, put it, put it whatever. And then like an hour later, I get a thing on my phone that says, your thing has over 1K. And I'm like, what? 1K? <laughs> yeah. What do you mean? Yeah. And I'm like, we're talking about whatever the fuck. Yeah. And it got, okay. Yeah. Time to do more. And so yeah. I try to make reels and clips. Like, like when I go live, it's all whatever, all whatever. But then as soon as this comes off, I'm like, shit all right i gotta see where we were and see what i can make clip wise mm-hmm. because people like clips more than the actual thing yeah they really do yeah that's that's what i'm starting to realize now that short short videos are the thing right now mm-hmm. nobody really wants to sit through a long video unless it's popping like unless it's a hype fucking video yeah and, and that's what gorilla mob is bro like right now like uh like my boy panda yeah Ryan. like right now uh he shoots like videos and how they look, like how the truck looks. Mm. I'm like, yeah, bro, you know, I like that too. But what can your truck do? Like, can, the, can it burn out? Can it? Can it put? Get? Can it fucking pull? Can it race? Can it do something? Like, looks are deceiving. Unless mm. your truck's a piece of shit, your looks don't count. Ooh. You know, like whatever. So I'm like, hey, that's what, that's what Grilla Mob is. Grilla Mob, yeah, your truck will look nice and all, but I need a burnout or else your truck's a piece of shit. Oh damn! That's bold words there too. That's because, bold words, but like it's also attention grabbing. Attention like, grabbing. Cause and that's all my friends too. I'm like, look, because some of my friends they tell me, hey bro, when are you gonna shoot a video of mine? I'm like, whenever you're ready to do, do a burnout. <laughs> and then after they hear a burnout, they're like, ah oh, hell, never mind. Hence why one price per burnout. Yeah, yeah the price we, is a burnout. There we go. Because yeah. that's good content. Yeah. And everybody wants some... to see a burn. Everybody loves a good burnout. I think why I think the meats were the way they were. Yeah. Because people were burning out. People were going crazy. That's yeah. what I, that's what that's what my goal is. I want to see I want to see Gorilla Mob be a, an aggressive page. That's why it's titled Gorilla. Yeah. Because the gorillas are aggressive. Exactly. And man, there are people like who might not be in your friend group. If you tell them price a burnout and they'll do it. They'll do it, yeah. Instantly. Yeah. And that's crazy. That's a weird. That's concept. a free. That's a basically a free fucking video. That's a free a video, a high video. You put yourself out there. You got your truck. You got some clout there. Both people win both ways. Yep. Damn. Pretty much. And you have a badass shot of your truck. There you go. There you go, man. Yeah. But then.